Last year, I didn't really know what to expect coming in. I feel like most most college freshmen typically don't, but uh, I kind of took the, took that year to kind of get you know learn the ropes and figure out everything I needed to be doing, how like how I needed to prepare myself mentally and physically for for the game and for that transition between high school and college. On the court, I realized that I have to be a totally different person. But I didn't always realize that, but that's something I've had to learn. So. The way you see me on the court is not going to be the same way I am just walking around. Like, it's two separate people. Off the court is more like a playful type, you know, happy, you know, they want to talk to everybody, just want to be like a part of everything. But on the court, it's just I'm locked in, I'm focused, I'm totally a different person. As a center, really, I'm really the, the last line of defense. When it comes to defense, like I'm the big guy in the paint or what have you. But, um, I feel like one of my strengths would be communicating. Another one of my strengths would be uh, scoring from the post or rebounding or changing or blocking shots if I had to. You know, I've, I've said it a lot about Lloyd Burgess. Uh, his size, uh, with, with the natural gifts he has, if he can continue to develop, he can be a difference maker in our program. Everybody in our office and everybody in that locker room is ready for Lloyd Burgess to emerge because it's 6'11 and 270 pounds or whatever he is, uh, he can really be a presence in the Southern Conference. So looking to him to keep taking steps. At this point, I kind of just want to be the best player I can be for my team. And whatever that is, I'm fine with that because overall, it's just it's all about what's best for the team. And I feel like that'll help kind of mold into the, into the team. Like we're starting to really set high standards around here and we're not accepting less anymore.